this one too. So we've got this uh, all jammed and we're putting the fenders on for the first time, the new fenders. The doors, of course, we Joe had to build up this weld. It was way off to make this work, but now it fits good. But uh, what's the problem with this one? The, the beaches right here. Okay, well that's Flat. not that's not a big deal. It's, the problem is this. grind this out. Okay, so it go over that that hump. Yep. Then I had to elongate the holes on these. Okay, this is what really freaks me out is this door here. Do you see how all of a sudden it just goes like that? It's just it's just a bad. I don't know how we're going to make this line up uh, perfectly. Maybe they never did. We had to push this away so that it would fit up to the um, windshield, post. windshield post. Yeah, and um, we jammed these last night. We're putting it together today to do a final block and paint this puppy. Everything has been blocked, and it's a final, final everything. We just and uh, shot the inner jams on both. These things, the uh, brackets that go on the fenders. Oh, is that right? Yeah, they go right here like this. Oh, okay. I couldn't get them to fit, because this thing here stuck out that far. Does this fender fit? Have you set it on there? Does it fit better than that one, or you haven't been able to set it on because this one, of... This one's worse than that one. Oh, really? Oh, great. Well, we're on it. I'm not sure how close we're going to get these to fit. I know they never fit, fit perfect from when they were new, but they had to fit better than this. Yep. So, we'll give you a progress report. Jams are painted. Outside is ready for a final wet sand. And then it will be painted. Joe is cleaning up the engine parts. It was beautiful. Just absolutely gorgeous. So that he can undercoat and do the lane. And we're going to paint these parts black, I believe. The horns and the hinges. I think it's cleaning up very good. This puppy's just about ready to be sprayed. 